Hey folks, today we're going to learn about how to take your Generation 3 Starlink that comes with this kickstand and install your Starlink tripod adapter. So, first we're going to flip this over. You can see your kickstand here. When you remove it, you want to make sure that you put two fingers in here, like so, and then you hold one thumb on top. And you don't want to do this with this up because you can put too much pressure here and break this. So. I'm going to put those two fingers in, one finger down, and I'm going to simultaneously pull out and sort of pull up a little bit, and it pops right out. If you need to reinstall it, you go ahead, slide it right back in, again, pull up with these two fingers, a little pressure here on the thumb, out and up. There you go. So here's the Starlink tripod adapter. 3D printed part, and here I have a quick release plate that I use with my tripod, which lets me easily take it on and off. To install it, you're going to align it so that the shorter end is facing the shorter end of your Starlink after you've removed the kickstand. And then you're going to put pressure right here, you're going to push down, and then you're going to push in at the same time. So we're going to push down and in, and these two feet will snap in right there. So here I really want to emphasize what's happening when you're pushing down before you push in. So when you push down, you're really just trying to flex this bit so it gets into that channel. And so you can see here, this is now in that channel. If I just try and push, it's never going to go anywhere. So it's really why you got to push down on the top, then push in from the back. And then once it's in that channel, it's very easy to continue pushing forward. So it's really about pushing down first to get it in that channel, pushing forward a little bit, and then once it's in there, you can easily click it forward with your thumbs. All right, so once you have your Starlink tripod adapter mounted, it's as easy as putting the quick disconnect plate on your tripod, and then just snapping it on. I think a ball head can be a nice tripod head because it lets you easily Rotate to the dish to the desired 45 degree angle and then lock it in place. You can also just pick up your tripod and move it. And then depending on your tripod, it should be easy to take it off or put it back on. To remove it, I like to just put a finger through each hole and then rest my hands on the side and I sort of pull up uh, on these two tabs while putting pressure on the side of my hands pops out real easy. So to install the cable, find an end with a tab. Tab should be up. Just push it in. Then you lay your tripod adapter on top. Just sort of route the cable through. There should be lots of uh, options through either the left, right, or the center. And then again, push down and in. Make sure everything is clipped in and you're good to go. When you're ready to remove, again, pull up a little bit in the center while pre placing pressure on the side of your hands, easily comes out. Pull the cable out, you're all set. Now I like to store my Starlink with the adapter installed, and I just pop it out on site if I need to.